What's up guys, it's A here from Tech Bomb and welcome to another unboxing on the channel. So today I'll be doing the unboxing on this James Donkey gaming mouse. So without wasting any more time, let's jump straight into the video. let's have a quick look at the box so um, as you can see there James donkey let us focus on there somehow there we go so James donkey and as I've just wrecked the box there but we can see a quick kind of demo of the mouse what it's gonna look like natural where are we natural born player 325 mouse Let's jump straight in this box. So, upon pulling this out, we find a, another. It's like a form. It's like a. It's like a form material with James Donkey log on there. I really like the way this is presented, and that reveals the beast under the box or under the form with another. Never walk alone logo with a dog donkey donkey I should say as we lift that up there's a cable there and some Chinese font on that label we just close that because I don't understand none of that so let's pull this out very carefully and pull that out the whole thing out there we go and we can pop that to a side at the bottom, it just kind of reveals the um, the option. So number one, well, it says number one there, and number one there is in Chinese. So um, I need a Chinese friend, somebody who is Chinese and watching this video. Please let me know what they mean in the comments down below. Right, that goes on the side. I like the way it was presented. But if there was English there, I would really, really enjoyed it. Now then, wow, this is lovely. This is this is this is awesome. Right, so where shall I start? On the top of the oh my god, I nearly kicked everything away. On the top of the mouse, we have a very nice matte finish, um, all over around. We have, I believe, they are the DPI settings. So high DPI, low DPI. We have a kind of meter kind of thing there so it kind of says x1000 start right up to max 3.0 so i believe that is the dpi settings and as far as i know as far as you as i've seen the picture on this um there's an led going across it kind of lights up as you go in towards the higher dpi setting we've got a forward and back key for our browser a very very nice comfortable hold i you know what this actually feels really comfortable already in hand and it's a very large um, claw gripper mouse, I should say. Very nice design. Um, I don't know what that is. Maybe just for display. At the bottom of the mouse, we have a metal kind of finish on there. Um, with a laser, optical laser sensor at the bottom underneath, hidden down there. And no on or off switch, obviously, because it's not wireless uh, and here we have our yellow cable um, it's not the normal cable this is like um, a very good quality I've got the name of this now um, if somebody remembers the name just drop it down in the comments below what the cable is called but um, let me just focus that uh, braided cable I think anything something like that anyway and it looks like a decent amount of cable probably about two to three meters um, and the USB so what I'll do I'll hook it up to my PC and um, I'll see you guys on the desk.
Oh, so I've got it now. Whichever way you go, it kind of cycles back around. So currently, it'll show you the first over there. And then if you press that again, we'll kind of come to there. We press it once more and we come to 2.0 and we press it the fourth time and it goes to 3.0 at max where the lights go red if you press up we kind of go the opposite way so we go back down and we go back down we go back down again and the led turns blue well quite unique and quite awesome um i'll probably keep it a bit higher dpi because um i don't like slow there we go but overall, very, very, very nice mouse. I really, really think this is a very nice mouse. Well, that's the unboxing and the overview on the mouse. Now, I'm going to again use this for a couple of, probably about a week or so, and um, see how this performs in some latest games, and see if it is really worth the money and do a review on this. Well, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you very much for watching the video. Give it a big fat massive thumbs up if you liked it and I'll see you guys in the next one.